welcome back to my channel i hope you're doing well or if this is your first time tuning in then welcome as you can see by the title of this video guys this is my first food grocery haul Do you know what the truth is i secretly like watching these videos guys i see people like watching them i like to watch what other families buy I don't know what it is about it, but I just do. I get little ideas about what foods I can buy for my family, what meals I can create. So I just thought I would just share my own. So this morning I did like my monthly food shop, um, which is why there's so much. And I did it alone, so I had enough time to get what I needed to get. And yeah, I thought I might as well share it with you guys. Um, it is quite a lot, so I'm going to try and get through this as quick as possible, just to share with you guys all the bits that I bought. Um... I don't know if I left anything or forgot anything, but I'll probably realise as I go through. But anyway, let's get started. So first thing first, I do my food shops in either Lidl or Aldi, and it's so amazing because they're literally opposite each other, so I can choose where I want to shop. I usually go for Lidl. Um, I just prefer Lidl, and it is a little bit more affordable now, you know, with the cost of living and everything rising. Um, but I do also like Aldi. Um, so, how much did I spend? Actually, should we tell you? Do you know what? I'm going to tell you at the end. I want you guys to guess how much I spent. I'm going to tell you at the end. But anyway, let's get started. So, to start off with, water. Guys, I drink a lot of water in my house. And to be honest, I usually don't buy the small ones. I usually just have the um, big bottles. So, I always buy one of these. Sometimes two. But this time, I bought one of these and two packs of the 500 milliliters because i find that it's easier for me to get my bottles in a day um whether i and i always tend to leave these around the house i leave some in the living room some upstairs in my room some upstairs in my office to make sure i'm getting my water in every day so i bought two of these one packet of the big water next of course i didn't expect to buy this but i saw it and i just thought this would be perfect so i bought this little bath um what do they call it it's yeah. actually in english no, it's not English, but basically it's a bath seat and um, currently Ruben is using the small one that I bought from Mamas and Papas, I think, where he lies down. He does not want to lie down anymore, guys. He doesn't want to lie down. He's just like, I want to sit up and play with my brother because I put them in the bath together. So this is perfect because he literally sits up in it and i can wash him and clean him whilst he's sitting in the bath i thought this was amazing and i just had to buy it i also bought two of these sleep bags to be honest the only reason why i bought this is because our washing machine hasn't been working for a few days someone's coming to fix it today yes and my son uh my my and my baby we sleep changed recently and one yeah. of like the um routines is to put a sleep bag on him before putting him down we have one sleep bag that is the same that is this weight the other ones are like the lighter ones for when it gets warmer um, and that one's dirty so i just bought this because i don't want him to sleep with that one tonight i want him to sleep with a clean one so i just bought this one just for him to have more than one anyway um, and it's disney it's really really nice and i bought six to eight months because the one that he has he's grown out of that one is um zero to six months and he's yeah he's literally stretching out of it so we've got this one i bought one of these because when people come to my house i want my house to smell nice i bought two of these um ultra soft tissues one for my office and one for james's office because um, of course you just need tissue at your desk and I found that we always had t loo rolls rather than tissue So these are just perfect just to have on your desk again. This is obviously because the same situation I bought just a new pack of sleep suits and these um, this is four to six months as well Large cleaning cloths dish cloths. Obviously, I just need them and of course the big Loo roll. I love buying this tissue. I think this is the favorite one that we buy This has got how many of them we have 24 so this usually lasts us a long time. So of course I bought it before I move on, guys, I need to quickly share this with you because I forgot my husband just reminded me that I picked it up from the other side. And this is the oat milk that my son has. It's the oat, uh, oat milk unsweetened, 100% plant-based. This is the milk that Joelle has and James has. I have dairy milk still. Um, I have oat milk here and there, but I just prefer the taste of dairy milk. I might change, but yeah, we'll see at some point. I bought 4, 8, 12 of these. So basically, a whole crate you can see at the back just so that... Um, I don't have to keep so that we don't run out and I just buy in bulk. Whenever I'm doing a monthly shop, it makes sense to just buy as much so you don't have to keep going back. That's the whole point of buying what you need and the amount that you need. Pasta is always needed in a family house. I've got two packs because pasta is just easy go to for my son as well and spaghetti. So two pastas and two spaghetti. Peppers, I always cook with peppers, so I bought four. 
um, this little cheesy pasta is for Jojo. Sometimes he likes it, sometimes he doesn't, but it's just one of those easy lunch options when I haven't cooked anything. Lettuce and cucumber. So I used to always buy the packs of salad, but now I've decided to start like cutting up my salads and just putting it in a big container so I can just throughout the week just take um, salad out. But I forgot some, so I've only got the lettuce and the, um, I've only got lettuce, cucumber, and I'm gonna add onions and sweet corn. That's gonna be my salad. Brussels sprouts, you can't go wrong with Brussels sprouts. Bagels, bagels is an easy breakfast option for me. I literally just have a bagel, cut it in half, and have it with um, butter and honey. Black seedless grapes are my favorite, had to get them. This is one of my favorite seasonings, um, and I'm so glad that Lidl sell them. I don't think they used to. Um, yeah, because I usually get them from like the African food shops, but yeah, I was able to get them in Lidl. Two sweet chilli sauces, guys. I love sweet chilli sauces. And let me tell you a secret here. Yeah, one of my secret recipes, um, like when I cook my chicken or my beef or, or cook any meat, I add a little bit of sweet chilli sauce. This I only bought because me and Jojo's going to make some pizza today. And you're also going to see what else I bought with that. Whenever I'm cooking and I need a gravy, I always add a nor stock pot so that I've got the chicken one and the beef one. Again, I said I was running out of season, so I just had to top up with a chicken one. Some honey, because my honey has finished. Um, these are like, me and James really like these drinks. So these are like in the evenings when we're having like movie night and we just want a nice cold um, drink, cider, flavoured cider. Um, then we have juice. We always buy two apple juices and two orange juice. Whenever it runs out, it runs out. That's basically it. These kind of snacks are a must because whenever I'm trying to be good and I don't want to have like bad snacks, which I've actually been quite good with, I just get snacks like this. So this is the um like the yogurt fruited little snacks, and this is the crispy ones, um, the raspberry ones. Um, and then let me show you these two before I move on to the other one. But these are my current favourite snacks from Lidl. I think I showed them on Instagram before. Absolutely love these. These pouches, I always just buy these to chuck in the bag, tuck in the kids' bag whenever I'm out. If for any reason haven't found time, they haven't found time to eat and he's not eating when he's out, or just to have a little snack on the way, I would always give him one of these and he just took one now. So these are my two treats out of the whole shop, guys. I am addicted to mini eggs and this is like the big pack, so obviously I had to get it. And this is just for my sweet jar, just to have a sweet jar in the house when anyone comes around and wants something sweet. This is actually the first time I bought these, um, these potato courgettes. These are going to be for Jojo because I've got an air fryer now. I tried to find little quick things that I can put in the air fryer that Jojo can have for lunch. And I really think he'll like these, so I bought these. Um, I also bought Mediterranean style vegetables just for dinners. Um, I bought two desserts for the month. I bought apple crumble. We've already got ice cream in the fridge and I bought sticky toffee pudding. Ooh, yeah. Some toasting waffles. Joel has started to try waffles, so I just bought these basically for him. I've got my eggs. Nowadays, guys, when you go, the egg is always sold out, so I'm glad I was able to get my hands on some egg. Sorry, yeah. I was just going past. Then I bought this pizza bases, um, two pizza bases because me and Joel are going to make some pizza. Sweet corn for Jojo and Daddy. Ham to go on top of our pizza. Mm. Spring onions, I never cook without spring onions. Absolutely never. Banana, which is my current favorite fruit. Kiwi, apples, mango, plum. sweet potato, because my son Ruben is weaning and we're gonna start introducing dinner, like veg vegetables and potatoes next week. Um, lemons. Some bread this usually goes within the first few days of course because it'll just be stale now we're going to move on to the meat so two salmon fillets just because me and James love salmon um beef steak chicken drumsticks chicken thighs and if you guys I don't know if you guys have noticed I like to buy my chicken without the skin because I always take the skin off unless I'm going to air fry or put it in the oven I like to cook without the skin so Lidl and Lidl has just saved so much time because I don't have to take off the skin and then oh unless I'm doing wings chicken wings frankfurters I can never pronounce them these are for Jojo now he tried them before and I bought them again to try them again um, he didn't really like them. I just bought them again for just a quick lunch option. Beef burgers, because James bought brioche rolls last week and we still haven't used them. We usually make our beef burgers for mince, but yeah, I just thought time, 
don't have the time let's just buy the burgers as it is i also put some mashed potato for jojo and some cooked um chicken slices because this is going to go on our pizza that we're going to make moving on guys if you haven't tried this yogurt from lidl you need to try it this is my favorite favorite yogurt and dessert i could sit down and just eat through these so i bought six for the month not all for me three for james actually two for james and four for me um absolutely love this yogurt it is i think it's like 65p each i think but i absolutely love them bought some yogurt for jojo pancakes just because we like pancakes in the house this is the yogurt that I would have with fruit. So I bought this big tub. I just find it so much easier to buy the bigger tubs. I really like these crispy um, like potato slices because um, I could just put them in the air fryer and it cooks so quickly. You can have them for lunch or dinner. Sweet corn, beans and hoops. Jojo loves beans and hoops. Tuna because Joelle loves tuna sandwich. I had to buy Aptimal 2 because I didn't have Aptimal 1 and we've actually ran out. Um, Ruben is six months next week so I thought he can get away with the six um, to twelve months just because I didn't have any time to go to another shop so I would usually buy one but he's going to be six months next week so I just thought I might as well get this one. Honey nut clusters is for me for my breakfast. I like to buy these for Joelle again for those days that it's just a quick snack or I'm out I could just put it in the bag and have it with a spoon if he needs it when we're out. Rusk because my son is weaning and he absolutely loves the rusks. I bought some nappy sacks because you can't get enough of nappy sacks and a six pack um, box of wipes, baby wipes, shower gel and bleach. I really like the shower gel by the way guys, it's really creamy. I've got to show you the cheese. I bought grated cheese because me and Jojo are going to make some pizza. <laughs> so guys, that's it. That's our monthly food shop. Um, I hope you enjoyed that. But before we go, of course I need to share how much I spent. How much do you guys think that I spent on the food shop? We spent... 232 pounds which is good because that's like around our budget for our monthly shop i hope you guys like this video let me know in the comment section if you did or if there's anything else like this you would like to see more food shops would you like to see uh, what i cook for jojo what i cook for the family i'd love to know what you guys would like to see um and thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video bye